party today if you haven't figured that out. And nothing says celebration like champagne. Especially with champagne <laughs> that's open with a saber. The method is called sabrage, and it has French roots. So Derek is live at the St. Regis in the Seaport where they're showing us how to do it properly. Hi, Derek. Bonjour, Boston. Oh, yeah. So it is a fabulous day here. We're talking champagne with Lawrence here at the St. Regis, Boston. Now, tell us a little bit about what we're doing today. So today we're going to be savoring or sabraging, as we say at St. Okay. Regis. Um, so this comes from the tradition at every St. Regis hotel. Love so it's that. called the evening ritual. Okay. So every day to celebrate the transition from day to evening, oh. um, you'll savor or sabrage a bottle of champagne for the guests. Okay, now tell me a little bit about the history of this because I think it's such a unique concept on what you guys do here, but also the history behind it. So it actually comes from Napoleon. So when Napoleon would return from battle, he would oh. go through the town and townspeople would hold their bottles of champagne out and the soldiers would savor bottles of champagne. Wow. So everyone really gets involved. It's yes. kind of a community thing. And what I think is very cool about the St. Regis, it's a community thing here for everyone that works here. Tell me about that. Yeah, so every St. Regis employee, their last part of almost like initiation into St. Regis, they actually have to savor a bottle of champagne themselves. Wow. Okay. And you had to do this? How many did, did you have to do? Uh, so everyone has to do at least one. Um, some people mess up their first try, but... How did you do your first time? I got it the first try, so I've done it a few times okay. now. So hopefully this one works. Let's do it. All I'm right. nervous. Okay. So this is a massive knife. Yes. I mean, okay. So what do you do? What is the process so like? Bring, walk me through how you, you actually, get ready for this. So you want to find the... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you want to find the seam of the bottle. Okay. And you want to point it up here. You don't want to spill right as you hit it. And you just want to follow the seam. You don't okay. want to cut your finger. Okay. So it. people that are doing this at home, what, what's a tip that you would give them? Uh, you got to let it sit upside down for an hour. Okay. Chill the uh, stem of the bottle. And, then and cold, should, right? Cold, very, very cold. cold. And it should work pretty easily. Okay, let's, let's do this. Let's All do right. it. Am I going to get hit in the face? No. Ah! Oh my gosh, cheers. Uh, cheers, Boston. Uh, you know me, I love Paris. I, I've had so many memories over there and I feel as though I'm right back in Champagne mm -hmm. smelling those beautiful leaves. Lawrence, thank you so much You're for, for, for cheersing us. Oh, <laughs> look at this Avuv moment. I'll send it back to you ladies in the studio. 